Following the reoccurrence of earth tremor in some parts of the Federal Capital Territory, the Federal Government has commissioned the Earthquake Monitoring Command and Control Center for Abuja. Take a listen. What I saw is boo! They bought the house while I'm sleeping. I just get out. Residents of the nation's capital, especially in Papi, Jahi, and Meitama, have had their share of experiences as the earth beneath them moved, causing some tremor. It was a moment of anxiety, fear, and palpable tension for most of them. People are living in fear, and meanwhile, most people are saying uh, the the earth is the earthquake or whatsoever that it happened in Japan. There are so many lives we are lost there. If we know the cause, then we have in mind that ah, maybe now uh, uh, it's, it's, it's a breakage of a stone that happened like that, or maybe they they they, they, they put bomb blasts uh, in a, in a, in a, in a desert of uh, Iraq. We will be away. Let's go, man, to look into this issue and you know find out what to, the problem to solve. However, there is no cause for concern. According to the experts, the tremor was mild. Our preliminary findings from the investigation conducted indicated that the tremor occurred around 12.26 p.m. within the vicinity of Panama Street in Mitama District. After field assessment, the NGSC determined that the intensity is in the neighborhood of about 3.0 on Mercalli intensity scale, which suggests that it is felt only indoors with windows shaking and lasted about one minute. Further inspections by the team dispatch revealed that there is no structural damage in the area as a result of the shake. Hence, Neymar was adequately briefed by the NGSC team on the spot. The residents were also consequently reassured that there was no cause for panic. The NGSA team are still conducting further assessment within the area. And we continue to update the public on any further development as a result of this. However, the federal government does not want to take chances in view of the frequency of the earth tremor, especially in the nation's capital. This is what informed the setting up of this earthquake monitoring command and control center in Abuja. Mission of the sense monitors we've been talking about, and uh, they will go a long way to monitoring activities of tremors, earthquake, locally and internationally. Locally, I mean within Nigeria, outside uh, uh, Nigeria. So I say 24-hour thing to send signals, and uh, if there are uh, uh, emergencies, there will be an alarm. The initiative is the result of an interministerial committee set up by the federal government to fashion out ways of tackling the challenge of earth tremors in Nigeria. The Nigerian Geological Survey Agency designed six station seismic monitors to be deployed across the country. However, following repeated tremors around Abuja, the initial program of national deployment was adjusted. A four-station Abuja network has therefore been put in place to have a closer and more effective oversight of the FCT. It will serve as control center for the four-station triangulation network located at the Nasarawa State University, Kefi, University of Abuja, Wagwalada, and Veritas University, Buari. The seismometer is to monitor earth tremor and earthquake that is naturally or artificially induced. The earth tremor uh, occurred in September and November. This uh, equipment was not yet installed, so it was actually difficult to uh, establish the precise magnitude and epicenter of the earth tremor. But now we have the facility to actually uh, understand the exact mechanism of earthquake and also improve our predictive capacity. The essence of the command and control center is to monitor a tremor and earthquake that is either naturally or artificially induced. When I say artificially or naturally induced, for example, if there are quarry activities that is above 
normal. We can pick it from this center and know the source or the location where the tremor is coming from. The government is hoping to conduct an airborne magnetic survey over Abuja to ascertain in greater detail the fracture systems that predispose the nation's capital to tremors.